hey guys, this has been a big week, and I know today is a holiday and a lot of people are off and, and doing things and not on social media, but I just wanted to take a few minutes here and uh, just remind you that God loves you no matter what. He's never going to leave you or forsake you. He's always going to be there. Nothing can separate us from the love of God. These are all promises in the Bible that God has given us. And I know that especially on holidays it gets hard. Uh, you see all the, you know, the Facebook and the Instagram and the stuff and maybe you don't have the the family or the friends that it seems like everybody else has. And uh, first off, I just wanted to throw out there that you cannot trust what you see on social media. Like I had a situation one time where like I literally watched this lady spend like 30 minutes setting up this perfect little breakfast scene with like her Bible and some... Um, one of those like specialty iced cookies and coffee and whatever on her back porch and then took a picture and like captioned it like just enjoying this beautiful sunrise on the porch and then like came inside packaged all the cookies back stuck them in the pantry and sat at her kitchen table in a bathroom drinking coffee so like the whole all of the work that went into that was just for like a fake scenario and I'm not saying all of your friends are completely fake I'm just saying that you can't look at social media and judge your life based on that that you have to know who you are and you have to be okay with it and um, I heard a statistic one time that more people commit suicide around the holidays than any other time of the year because that's when you start feeling that loneliness and that's when you start getting all of these thoughts in your head that just convince you that somehow you're the only one that doesn't have a perfect family or you're the only one that doesn't have 30 friends to do friends giving with or whatever and and that's just not that's just not the case you know nobody has a perfect family nobody has any of those things and you know it's great to look at social media and rejoice with your friends when things are happening and be happy for them but at the end of the day you have to know all that matters is you and God and your relationship with him. And if you know who you are in Christ and you know what you're called to do, then you are going to be okay. No one can stop you from doing what God's called you to do. No one can do it for you. No one can make it happen. You have to step out there and do it yourself. But once you start walking in that direction and doing that thing that just fulfills you, that thing that God put inside of you to do, no one can stop you. Not you know, Your family can't. Your lack of family can't. Your friends can't. Your lack of friends can't. If God needs people to be in your life, he's going to send those divine connections and those people to help you and bring you up to the next level and, and be those resources and guides that you need. Who will hook you up with the right people? Just don't let anything distract you from what you've got going on in your life. You are powerful. You are destined to do great things. You have a purpose for being here. People need you. People are waiting on you to do the thing that God sent you here to do. So just don't don't get too distracted by the whole holiday you know, who are on Facebook and Insta and all that. Just just be you. Do you. If you feel yourself getting a little down, you want some friends, maybe make a phone call. You know, do something to, to, to get, you know, connected to somebody. We need personal connections. This quarantine has been terrible. We need personal connections with people, especially people who can encourage us and lift us up and, and keep our head straight and thinking the right things. Um, so I'm praying for you guys. I hope you guys have a great holiday weekend. Stay safe. Know God loves you. And be good.